Ashley, thanks very much. 604 right now after a lifetime of service to this state and to the country. Longtime U.S. Senator Paul Sarbanes has died. WMR 2 News Mark Ropers live at the Inner Harbor right now. Mark Sarbanes' son, who is now a congressman, is the one who broke the news about his father's death. Yeah, good morning, Christian. Like father, like son, the Sarbanes name has been part of Malin po politics for decades. U.S. Congressman John Sarbanes, which represents several counties, which makes up Maryland's third district, and the younger Sarbanes broke the news that his father passed away peacefully last night. Now, U.S. Senator Paul Sarbanes served in Congress from 1977 until 2007. He won re-election several times. In fact, in the year 2000, he became Maryland's first U.S. senator to win a fifth term, and the Watergate scandal happened right in the middle of his first year in Congress. The Democrat drafted the first article of impeachment against Republican President Richard Nixon. Now, before being a U.S. senator, John Sarbanes served time in the House of Representatives and in the Maryland House of Delegates. Sarbanes decided not to run for re-election in 2006 and was replaced by Senator Ben Cardin in 2007. Now, of his father's death, Congressman John Sarbanes says, our family is grateful to know that we have the support of Marylanders who meant so much to him and whom he was honored to serve. Following state, local, and public health guidance amid the COVID-19 pandemic, our family will hold a private service in the coming days. Now, we're here at the Inner Harbor right now, and Maryland's waterways were very important to Sarbanes. He had a passion for protecting them, and he's known for his work in preserving the Chesapeake Bay. We're live at the Inner Harbor. Mark Roper, WMAR 2 News. Mark,